Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Cody Adams. President Joe Biden meeting with his national security team at Camp David Saturday about Russian aggression against Ukraine. The president was briefed on the current state of Russian military operations along Ukraine's borders. His top military advisors also providing an update on the delivery of security assistance to deter the invasion. Diplomatic efforts are still underway with America's allies and partners to de-escalate the crisis. President Biden again affirming that the U.S. is ready to impose swift and severe consequences on Russia if necessary. Meanwhile, Ukraine has received a second weapons supply shipment from the United States amid the looming threat of a potential Russian invasion. It contained more than 80 tons of weapons to strengthen defense capabilities, according to Ukraine's defense minister. The first shipment of security assistance from the U.S. had arrived in Ukraine on Friday. The shipments come as the U.S. has sought to convince Moscow to de-escalate the situation at the Ukrainian border. Meanwhile, the U.S. State Department announcing it would reduce staff levels at the U.S. Embassy in Kiev, beginning with the departure of non-essential staff and family members. State Department officials say that the decision is out of a caution and that the threat to us to U.S. personnel in the country has not increased in recent days. Still, the move underscores the fears of potential Russian invasion, which U.S. officials have warned could be imminent with tens of thousands of Russian troops along the Ukrainian border.